असलम एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल लिंगोस्टिक एंड लिटरेचर नॉट्स इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द गुड मोरो बाय जॉन डन सो दिस इज़ वन ऑफ द मोस्ट फेमस पोइम्स ऑफ जॉन डन दिस पोइम कंसिस्ट ऑफ थ्री स्टेंजाज इट वॉज पब्लिश इन सिक्सटीन थर्टी थ्री इट वॉज पब्लिश इन डन्स कलेक्शन ऑफ पोइम्स टाइटल सॉन्ग्स एंड सोनर्स so we can say that this poem is about two lovers the narrator is narrating his own love story the narrator reflects on what life was like before they fell in love with their partner they wonder if they were like children innocently enjoying simple pleasures in the countryside or if they were dormant like the seven sleepers in a cave they realize that any beauty they saw and desired in the past now feels like it was only a dream of their beloved so as the poem progress they greet their awakened souls they relieve that they no longer fear separation because now they are together love now dominates their thoughts their love is transforming a small room into a place that feels expensive and all encompassing they acknowledge that while explorers venture to new lands and maps reveal endless worlds they have time that they cherish the world they share together as one the narrator is looking into the partner's eyes he is saying that they see their own reflection and feel their partner's presence mirrored back at them they believe that true love is evident in their sincere hearts reflected in their faces they ponder where they could find two better halves of the world without the harsh north or the fading west you can say that the narrator is in deep love with his partner so you can say that narrator believes that anything that fades away was not perfectly balanced so the narrator concludes that if their love unity is as one or if their love for each other is so similar that neither can weaken or perish i hope so these notes will be helpful for you thank you for your participation if you like the video please subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for more updates